Hello, hiya, I'm Mandy, Spiritual Tarot and Mystic Oracles. Right, today I'm going to do a reading on, a tarot card reading, on Judge Eileen Callan. Uh, she's indefinitely pros postponed Donald Trump's federal trial in Florida, right, over his alleged mishandling of classified documents while in an office. There's a lot of evidence against him. He's, you know, hung, drunk, hung, drawn and quartered. You know what I mean? It's like, it's a, it's a foregone conclusion. But Judge Cannon has decided to cancel. Uh, it says her court order on Tuesday cancelled the 20th of May 2024 start date she had previously set for the proceedings. Okay. So it says the trial is now unlikely to begin before the 5th of November's U.S. elections. So um, I'm going to do a reading. I'm going to ask why. Why this sudden change? Judge Cannon, I think she was one that he just put in there quickly. He made her a judge quickly. I don't really know all the background and the history of it. If you can hear little scratches, that's my um, dog. She's a British Bull Terrier. A British Bulldog. There she is. See? My British Bulldog. <laughs> She's in her. She never leaves me. Right, so carry on. Judge Arlene Cannon, why has she postponed or indefinitely postponed Donald Trump's federal trial in, uh, in Florida over his alleged mishandling of classified documents while in office and also trying to keep them? He was, you know, he kept them even after he was in office. The former president is accused of keeping top secret documents in his possession after leaving office rather than return them to the National Archives as prescribed by law. Right, so what's, she, what's going on with Judge Cannon? Judge Eileen Cannon. Spirit guys, spirit mentors, force of truth and love. Show me the cards I need to see so that I can give clarity in my tarot reading to my viewers to help me better understand what's going on what's the underlying reasons for Judge Cannon to postpone Donald Trump's federal trial in Florida over his alleged mishandling of classified documents. Um, undelivered promises. So the promise was that on the 20th of May, this month, all right, this year, that there was going to be, there was a date set by Judge Cannon, right, for the 20th of May. And this is undelivered promises. It was all talk, all right? So she had no intention of it anyway, by the looks of it. Why? Because this is for punishment, yes, and it's being delayed. There you go. You got the hangman, so we've got it. Indecision as well. It's being delayed. Yes, yeah, been cancelled. Cancelled, cancelled event. Right. No completion, no closures hanging over it. 
No completion, no closure, no movement. Because she's indefinitely postponed it. And this is what it's saying, it's indefinitely postponed, yeah. That's what it says. It's a misuse of power. And they have misinformation and failed communication. Okay? And it's tyranny. Misuse of power. She's made the wrong choice. Right? Deceiving herself for him. Made the wrong choice. Look, come on. <laughs> She's trying to get up behind me. <laughs> Right, just move them over. She needs more money. She's put. Too, she's oh, she's concerned. She's put too much into this. She needs more money. More money. She's working with someone. She thinks this is a practical solution. Okay. And it's dark money because that's above this one. Okay. So that's why I put those two together. She's doing it for money because she needs the money. And... As a practical solution. And working together. She's not just her, she's working with someone. The fear here, hopes and fears, is law and order and legalities. Justice served. Justice served. That's a fear, our fear. Is that justice is going to be served and there's going to be law and order and cause and effect and legalities and accountability and honour. Justice served. That's the justice card. That's what she fears. All right, then we've got the Emperor. She's egotistic and thinks she's in control of this. All right. But she's not. She's going to learn a lesson from this. She's concealing something. You know, I reckon, you know, she's disguised as a judge, really, to be honest. Because if she was a judge, she'd do the right thing. And let it go ahead in May. Okay, and she's guilty. She's guilty for this. Well, maybe she knows that Trump is guilty. She's MAGA, isn't she, I think? Or Republican. Yeah, so uh, that's it. Well, she knows Trump's guilty. And money could be exchanging hands. Lena. Because she needs the money. Well, let's just see how it plays out, eh? Hopefully things will change and hopefully she'll be, you know, discovered. 
they'll realise what she's all about. I think they do. Because it's all over the news. You know, everybody's talking about it. Nobody's happy about it, apart from her and Donald Trump. So, there. I hope you enjoyed that. I hope that was helpful. Until next time, I'll see you next time. And hopefully you can like, subscribe, leave a comment, share. Okay, um, if you want me to answer any, you know, read on anything, just leave it in the comments. As long as it's something I can read on the YouTube about politics or the royals or something like that. As long as you ask me a question about the royal family, I'll, I'll you know, I'll answer it. You know, other than that, I don't want to really read on them, to be quite honest. But if you want me to, I will. All right. Until next time, bye-bye.